Happening now, the impact of Colonial Pipeline shutdown being felt right here in Metro Atlanta. Governor Kemp issued an executive order on Tuesday suspending the state's gas tax to help with rising prices at the pump. Now, according to Gas Body, about 10% of gas stations in Georgia are currently out of fuel. Good Day's Brooke Zahner joins us live from DeKalb County with more. Brooke, good morning. Yeah, good morning to you, Buck. So many people out there looking for a gas station that has gas flowing. And some drivers were lucky enough to find this quick trip here in DeKalb County where a tanker truck truck just came in about 30 minutes ago and got the gas flowing here as well. But according to Gas Buddy, nearly 50% of Metro Atlanta gas stations now without gas. And many gas stations in the area have either run out completely or they've set limits on how much gas one customer can buy. So the impact we know is being felt not just here, but across the East Coast. Colonial Pipeline supplies nearly 50% of fuel on the East Coast. Now, Governor Kemp's executive order halts the state's gas tax, and it also increases weight limits on tanker trucks that are getting fuel to the state. The governor has also encouraged people not to go out and panic buy gas, but even still, many panic drivers are are worried about what kind of impact this shutdown could have on them. I went out last night because she was concerned that the prices were going to go up. I said, well, you know, hey, don't worry about it, you know, but I had no idea they were going to jump this this significantly. I had no idea that it was going to be like this. Now, there is a hotline set up right now for any drivers out there who believes they may be experiencing price gouging because of this. The governor has not allowed that to happen. But again, the governor also encouraging people, if you don't need to get gas, please don't go out and get it because that just is adding to a problem and making it much worse. Reporting live in DeKalb County, I'm Brooke Sonner for Good Day Atlanta. All right, Brooke, thank you.